what is up guys it is mac and i just wanted to do a very quick unboxing video of a package that i got from alter ego running now if you remember a while back i have made a video on this company in the past and as a disclaimer i am a ambassador for this company so they did send me this hat for free i just paid for shipping um and yeah it is the second i guess mid-year hat that they gave to all of the uh ambassadors and if you don't know what Alter Ego Running is, it is a company that specializes in making running hats. And I have been using their hat a lot. This is the last hat that they sent me. This is the original ambassador Alter Ego Running hat that they sent. Um, and this one is, as you can see, a coaster hat. I believe the one in this box is the Trotter hat, if I'm not mistaken. So we're gonna unbox it and see what the differences are between the two hats. Um, so without further ado, let's get into it. So here is the packaging uh, basic box here. It does have the Alter Ego Running logo there and it does have this really cool Alter Ego Running tape. So let's go ahead and turn it here and we'll cut the tape real fast. Now they do have different styles here. Um, I'll just quickly go through them once I open up the box. And I'm not gonna lie, the hats are a little pricey, but the quality of the hats is absolutely worth it. Uh, I just haven't bought any hats myself yet because again, as I said, they're, they are a little pricey, but um, considering that I'm a full-time college student, I can't exactly buy these hats, but I am very thankful for when they send hats out. Um, and this is one of them that they sent. So here you go, here is the top part of the packaging and it says Alter Ego Running. And there is a lot of social media, so Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, and YouTube. So let's see here. Oh, very cool, very nice packaging here. So here we go, got some black, I guess, wrapping paper here. Oh, uh, let's take this out. Just my order confirmation. Uh, oh, it says, thanks for being an ambassador. So that's a very awesome, very cool. And here is the hat. Oh, and they sent something else as well. Let's see what this is first. Oh, this is cool. Looks like it's just a little pamphlet here. So game changer, over 3,000 five-star reviews. Alter your running. There you go. If you want to scan the QR code there, if you want to learn more, you can. And here it is, wow. This looks awesome. I knew I was getting the black color, but um, man, I don't know. The black color looked a lot better than I thought. I was between, basically they gave us a choice of getting either the uh, black version of this, which I got, or a white version. I almost went with the white version. But man, seeing this black in person, I don't know, I liked it. I like it a lot better than I thought I would. So let's get into this. So let's see here. If I can get this bag open. Oh man, they never cease to amaze me with their quality. Like this thing, it's just nice, nice looking. So here it is, the Alter Go Ambassador hat. And let me see if was I right about this one. This is the, oh, I was wrong. This is the Traveler hat. So it is a little bit different, but man, look at that design. It's so cool. So nice. I love it. Alter Go running. You can see the original price, $49. Honestly, I mean, I said it's pricey. It's not that bad for a hat, especially considering that most like baseball hats go for 50 to $60 now. So if you get to get a really nice high quality hat like this for 50 bucks is honestly not bad. I just say it's a little pricey for me considering that again, I'm a college student. So I can't really be going on my way to buy these, but again, super thankful to Alter Ego Running for seeing this to me for free. Again, I just covered shipping costs. Um, and yeah, man, absolutely beautiful hat. So we'll do a quick size, or this comparison here. I'm just gonna say size comparison. Um, and yeah, you can see there's definitely some differences here in the bill. Uh, I was not expecting the bill to be a lot wider on this hat compared to the coaster hat. Uh, let me see if I can just pull up the description of the two hats real fast. 
So let me see. This one was the traveler hat, and this one is the coaster hat. So let's see what they say about each hat. So let's start with the traveler hat. So it says it is a unstructured and carefree fit. So uh, one thing you can definitely tell the, well, here, first of all, I'll take this out. So when they say unstructured, they mean the, um, I guess, what do you call this? A crown is, has less structure compared to this one. You can see how this one's nice and firm. This one is not. So it's a more, I feel like it's a more casual look. So let's see what it says. It says, uh, get ready for your next adventure with the Traveler Fits, a hat designed to keep you stylish, comfortable, and dry no matter where the journey takes you. So yeah, so it says here, unstructured front panel. So that's what I was talking about here. Modern semi-high crown and advanced hyper water repellent material. So there you go. Um, so yeah, this one, they mark it more as just a um, hat for traveling. So it says, from hiking, camping, exploring to relaxing, this hat is built to withstand the elements and keep you feeling, uh, keep you looking and feeling your best. Embrace your sense of adventure and upgrade your wardrobe. So yeah, there you go. That's your traveler fit. Um, and then let's see what they say about this. I feel like is kind of their main hat, their coaster fit. So it says it's a redefined trucker hat built for running and all day. So this is, they mark it more as a running hat compared to this hat as they mark it more as just a chill hat. Um, and I have been using, as I said, I have been using this hat for running and it's been great. Um, absolutely love the hat, love how breathable it is. Um, both hats have this nice breathable material here in the back. As I said, they're both, um, what was it, water, is it waterproof, water resistant? Let's see. So the coaster hat says, um, so yeah, structured front panel. So this one has a low crown and conforms to natural rounded contour of the head. Hat offers a sleek and stylish look, crafted with our exclusive Hyper Poly Plus fabric. So this one has a Hyper Poly fabric. I wonder if this one also has that same fabric. So let's see here, the traveler hat. Um, doesn't say it has that same fabric. It just says that it can withstand the elements and, um, Hyper, so this one has hyper water repellent material and the coaster hat has the hyper poly fabric. So don't really know what the difference is. It just says it's lightweight, breathable, also designed to deliver exceptional performance and durability. So this hat is definitely more durable than this hat. Um, so comparing the differences, this one has a high crown, um, flat, nope, more curved bill shape and a, I guess, classic hat type is what they consider this one. And then comparing it to this hat, the traveler hat, it's crown height high. The bill shape is a little bit more flat than it is curved. And this one they consider to be more of a modern compared to classic. So two different types of styles of hats that Alter Ego Running wears. Um, and if you're curious of the other hats, they have the Cruiser Fit, um, which is, I feel like more geared for distance running. Um, the Drifter hat, which is more of a typical, I don't know what you call it. You know, it'd be easier if I can just show you here. So there you go here, zoom in a little bit here and turn off this light. So you can see there's the Cruiser hat. Drifter hat, trotter hat, coaster. So there's the coaster hat, the one, the first one I got. Here's the trotter, the drifter, cruiser, traveler, and they also have visors. So those are all the different hat types in case you're curious. Um, very satisfied with this hat. Very satisfied with both these hats actually. I uh, highly, would highly recommend Alter Ego Running. As I said, they've been great to me. Um, we'll definitely have to buy more of their hats in the future once I actually, you know, have more money. Because so I definitely want to try out the uh, Cruiser hat. Or, wait, is that the hat? Yes, yes, the Cruiser hat. Because um, that seems like to be a very popular hat for them. And they only make very limited styles and they usually sell out very fast for the Cruiser hat. So, 
Um, for pricing, I think all the hats go for about $49, if I'm correct. I'm just comparing the prices real fast here. Yep, they all seem to be priced at $49. So again, I said they were a little priced at the beginning. In reality, they're not that bad for what you're getting. High quality hats, great for running or just everyday activities. Um, and they look great. They have awesome designs. Um, these ones, as I said, are just limited to the Ambassador program. So you won't find these ones online. But they have a lot of other ones. They just released a USA collection for the Olympics, which looks really cool. And I believe they actually have one on sale right now. Um, let me see, they do. Hat of the month. Pretty cool, it's got like a little USA. I right, can show it here real fast, why not? So for 29 bucks, you get this really stylish looking USA hat just in time for the Olympics. Looks very cool. I love that design. So there you go. Uh, anyways, Alter Ego running. Um, and I do have a discount code if you're interested. I believe it is Cormac6, C-O-R-M-A-C, number six. And that should give you 20% off. I just want to try it out real fast just to make sure that is correct. Let's see, proceed to check out. Um, let's see, discount, there we go. So if I put in the code, apply it, and yes, it does give you the discount. Um, but again, I believe it's 20% off if I'm not mistaken, but there you go. Just in case you want to see for proof, there it is. Carmack 6 saved me five bucks on a tap. I was going to buy it, so $23. Again, really good price there for that hat. So yeah, as I said, I'll take a running if you're interested. Use my discount code Cormac6. Uh, great, great hat company. Um, and then one more thing that I want to do is just put on both of the hats. That way you can kind of see what the differences are and how it actually looks when you're wearing the hats. Okay, first of all, excuse my hair. I was outside for most of the day, so I'm very sweaty and very tired. But we'll start first with the coaster hat, so the hat that I've been wearing. So there you go, you can kind of see that. It has more of a structured fit here. So there you go, side view, side view. There you go. And then we'll put on the new hat here, the um, traveler hat. So I might have to adjust this, so let's put this. Let me see, what do I have it on the coaster hat? You can see there are snapbacks, so. Some people don't like snapbacks. Honestly, I'm not the biggest fan of snapbacks, if I'm being honest. But these ones, again, I don't mind. They're pretty nice. And one other thing to notice is, oh, never mind. I was gonna say, this one felt a little harder than this one, the actual snapback, but they, they're the same. So uh, anyways, we'll put on this hat next. It's still a tag on it, but there you go. Ooh, that's actually pretty tidy. It might have to loosen it a little bit for this hat anyways. This guy is supposed to be more of a loose, kind of more relaxed fit, so. There you go. I'm not gonna lie, yeah. They weren't lying, this hat is super comfortable. I don't know which one I like better, if I'm being honest. I don't know. It's built super nice. It's hard to, I guess, explain the differences are when you're actually wearing them, but I don't know, this one just feels a lot more, I don't know, maybe I'd, again, have it tight. Cause I feel like with this hat, it's supposed to be tight, especially if you're using it for running this hat. I mean, it's supposed to be a loose, relaxed fit, so I'm just gonna try to loosen it a little bit more. But again, this hat's super comfy. This would be like a great hat for you just going out on the beach. Oh yeah, there you go, that's nice. That's nice, not squeezing my head too much. Again, more of a relaxed fit, you can see that. Very cool. Again, awesome design in the back here. But yeah, so this would be a nice hat for just lounging out on the beach or you know, if you're going to the airport to travel or when you like to wear hats like I do, this would be a perfect travel hat. Um, I guess that's why well, it's called the Traveler. But yeah, awesome hats. So there you go, Traveler, Coaster, um, and yeah. One last thing I wanna mention with these Alter Ego hats, they all have a little pocket here on the inside. So if you just remove this tab here, uh, you can actually store stuff inside the hat. So you can fit like your keys um, or whatever else while you're traveling or running, any small items, 
you can just fit inside your hats and it's very handy for that so again um, especially for runners out there that don't want to carry stuff in their pockets um, and you, you know obviously you need to have your key with you again store it in your hats run with it and you're good to go so very cool and again all the hats have it this one has it too so there you go you can see that this one i will say it feels like the pocket on this one definitely goes a little bit deeper compared to this one or maybe not maybe i just didn't break this one in all the way but you can see my finger basically goes all the way to here so there you go you can see the difference there and on this one so there you go anyways that's what i did for my little spiel on rt alter ego running uh, again made this video a little bit longer than i wanted to but just wanted to shout them out and just kind of talk about a little bit about the company and my experience with them um again very cool company very glad to be a part of their um ambassador program um and they make excellent awesome quality hats so uh, definitely go check them out if you like hats, if you're a runner, um, or, you know, you're just, as I said, enjoyer of hats. You can't go wrong with Alter Ego Running. Um, use my discount code CORMAX6 if you're interested in saving 20% off. And, um, yeah, also want to mention this is probably going to be my last video for at least the week just because I've been crazy busy back in school and I got some major exams coming up. So I wanted to at least post one more video out. Um, so I probably won't have any videos next week um, and I apologize to you. I'm probably have to delay my live stream as well uh, I know I did say that I would um, continue to do it and I will it's just got to get through the rest of my summer classes and it's getting to the final stretch uh, a little stressful but we'll get through it um, and yeah so stay tuned as I said more videos coming soon just probably not anything for the next week or so uh, so anyways, all that all, all the way, hope you guys enjoy. If you have any questions, comments, or concerns about Alter Ego running, or just in general, let me know in the comments below. Uh, don't forget to subscribe as well as turn on the notification bell so you don't miss any future videos. Uh, join the Discord and the Instagram, do all that good stuff, and I will see you guys next time. Peace.